CBD acid. Hello, welcome to the Can Education channel of CV Sciences. I'm Lex Pelger. These are the wonderful products of Plus CBD. And in this relief product is CBD, CBD acid, and PEA. So what is CBD acid? CBD acid is actually the most abundant cannabinoid in nature, but there's been less than 100 studies published about it. So CBD acid is the raw form of CBD that is produced directly in the plant. It takes heating or treating the CBD acid to convert it into the CBD. CBD acid was first isolated in 1955, and that early research focused on the sedative properties. But now it's been most widely studied for nausea, gastro protection, and gut health. In animal models, it's been looked at for anxiety, for the lowering of inflammation and pain, for its anti-tumor effects via changes to genetic transcription, and in a model of Alzheimer's working with THC acid to protect the brain and to rescue memory deficits. One thing it's well known for is for its safety. And the most common use now is for gut health. If you know about that growing trend of people juicing the entire cannabis plant and then drinking the juice, that's because of what CBD acid does for gut homeostasis and for gut health. So what does it do at the biochemical level? There, CBD acid raises anandamide levels, it activates a serotonin receptor, it acts as an antioxidant, it regulates genetic transcription, and inhibits the COX-1 pathway, which is a pathway also used by aspirin. Also, many patents exist for CBD acid, including for anti-nausea, for autism, for cancer, and for inflammatory skin conditions. Interestingly, the team of Raphael Mashulam, who is known as the father of the endocannabinoid system, they came up with a more stable version of CBD acid to use as a drug, and it's called CBD acid methyl ester. And it's been looked at as a treatment for treatment-resistant depression, as well as schizophrenia. So, to give CBD acid a try, check out the relief gummies that have CBD acid, CBD, and PEA, which I've covered in other videos, but I'll probably do another one uh, coming up soon. And as always, on the cannabinoids, ask me anything.